Hi there, this video is meant to give you some updates about new features using Coggle on the iPad. If you want to learn how to use Coggle, watch my original video that's linked below. This is just to share some updates with you. So first of all, Coggle itself is pretty much the same, but there's some cool new features. The first one is when you click to add another link to your mind map, you're going to notice that instead of opening um, or just letting you write it in right there, it opens up this new screen. So this is where you're actually going to type whatever it is that you want to put into your bubble. The cool new feature though is if you click these three buttons in the top left hand corner, or three dots, excuse me, um, you're going to notice that a new feature is you can add a picture that's either saved to your camera roll or you can take a picture directly from your iPad and put it right into your mind map. So that's pretty cool. Um, so instead of just having words on your mind map, you can also add images to go along with it. Another cool new update is in my last video, I shared with you that trying to share your Coggle with somebody else from this screen wasn't that great. I told you to go back to the home screen, but that's since been fixed. Now, all you need to do to share your Coggle with somebody so that you guys can both work, it, work on it at the same time is to click this plus button up here and then go ahead and put their email address directly into this little box. What that does is it shares your Coggle with somebody else and you guys can work on it together, kind of like a Google Doc. The last new feature is there's also a download button. Um, it's this down arrow right here that lets you save your Coggle as a PDF or an image. Um, again, your Coggles will save forever in your account unless you choose to delete it. But if you want like a permanent copy in some other format, there's this download feature as well. So those are three new updates to Coggle on the iPad that I thought would be really helpful to know about. I'm especially excited about the ability to add images and the fact that it's easier to share with other people now.